Tom, uh, Mike, and Ian. That's it. Brooklyn 82. Tom, I know you love that one. Huh? I wasn't told that the trio had to be people because when I thought of trio, it doesn't. It doesn't. I'm, going, I'm going BLT. You know oh, why? Because great. you always hunger for more. <laughs> No wow. matter, and you think, how does it make such a, a, a perfect <laughs> mm. trifecta? And yet they do. They're savory, and we always want more from they them. They go with so many different things. Yeah. I, I feel awful because these are my guys, these are my boys, but when I see the three box go up, and it's the three of them in a row, and the one guy, there's Ian, he's got the tight, black, jet black hair. Yeah. Then yeah. you got Tom usually in the middle. It's kind of like a poof with like a bigger set of hair that's and then you got <laughs> then you got, then you got then, that's oh. when when ian's trying to report on rogers he's like i'm trying to think but nothing happens like that's yeah. that's absolutely perfect and there's like hijinks between the three of them all week because they they're punch drunk they've been on camera for like you breaking down time. someone's tv hair is like michelangelo yeah. talking about someone's painting like that well, you're the man look at that well, thing yeah you'll take well, your flowers huh <laughs> Come what else do we have? Appreciate it. James Palmer, Sarah Walsh, Jason McCordy, they got their whiteboards. I'm going to give you multiple choice. Yep. Huh? One of the names on the list is a real, actual NFL prospect who will either be drafted oh. or signed after this. Huh? Two of them are just nonsense names that I made. I have, I have an answer ready, or whether it's <laughs> Let's the see answer, it. we'll find out. I'm going with C. Uh, Bobo. Uh, huh? Hey, hey, wah, wah. They're all amazing names. I, I don't know. Bobo. You got it. Sarah Walsh. For the love of God, let this be a real name. I, <laughs> want, Timothy, hey, hey. I want Timothy Hey Hey on my team. Hey 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 Hey. hey, hey. hey. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The kid from Philly wants Wawa. Always <laughs> wants Wawa. Oh, and oh. So I'm going B. There Wawa, go. please. Uh, see, there's in this game. There's always the name that you hope. Sir, what do you got, Walsh? Um, I'm gonna go C Revenue, because he went salary. Great. Revenue. Now, Jason, you want to make it a perfect sweep, or are you going to go revenue I, as well? I, I went with C I already. The C worked last time, so I think that may be a theme that I'm going with today. I'm maybe just sticking with C and gain some revenue. They say if you do C on, every, on the SAT for every question, like, you can get a passable score. That's what they say. That's what they say. Um, did it work? Mason McCourty is the only person who has a point. One, oh, his plays zero, are against zero. one team. My goodness. He had a hell of a game. <laughs> yeah, hell of, yeah. Made a lot of income on that one. Jeez. Guys, yeah. we need some scores here. Jason cannot sacks. win this thing one to nothing. So... Clearly, I'm just going to go Vanderbilt. Um, that's my deductive reasoning. CW Snape. See, see, by the way, that's a very Vanderbilt sounding name. It really it is. True. His, his great great grandfather went to Vanderbilt. He needs CW Snape the fifth. Yeah, he's walking right? into Snape. W Snape the fifth. Yeah, he's walking right? into Snape. Railroad air. <laughs> Great, you're right. To air to the, like the railroads. Correct. That's perfect. Correct. Yeah. Or steel. Never mind. CW State doesn't even need to <laughs> right. play football. Palmer, I, I, I like that Jason's game shows. You, you, you're not. You're a little bit nervous. You, you don't feel like yourself. Are you all right? <laughs> no, I love this one. All right. Yeah. Well, maybe you get one of these right. One of these questions. Speaking if you love I'm it so even much. See, Le Jason Wicker's not. Again, I don't think it's Wicker's probably not. real, but. Oh my God! I hope it is. And by the way, uh, Wickersnot also sounds Incredible. like he might have gone to Vanderbilt. Y and you know what? Maybe so. Maybe it's because I cheated and I saw they went with B and C, and I got to get back in the game, right? Yes. But also, like Trey Victor, like I'm thinking, like that dude needs to be playing hoops. Like, can't you picture every time Trey and potentially for the win from the Peach Basket? <laughs> I'm going Voorhees. Okay, you're gonna go with Voorhees. Mm -hmm. Sarah Walsh. Who are you going with? I gotta go opposite James. You're, I don't you have, have a, a brand. I don't have a choice. Willie Panay wise, yeah. potentially for the win. Jason McCourty, you could lose this or um, you could win it of all brains. of that. Follow no. our Instagram page at GMFB for the BTS stuff. What do we got, Sarah? What did, what did James and I film? Was that a TikTok thing we did the Probably. other day that yes, we've never TikTok. done before? Probably. But it goes on Instagram. Somewhere. It's so cool. Yeah, Maddie had us do it. I don't know that we were great at it. No, I, I was didn't dreadful. Feel, I didn't feel solid uh, with Jamie that performance Jamie usually leads whatsoever. the charge sometimes yeah, with help, and we do the voiceover, and I always suck at it. Yeah, I wasn't how. great. I thought you crushed it on that one. Very yeah, I do I do okay yeah, once in a while. I, I just like that shameless plug that we and just Maddie we trust, at apparently. End. At GMFB on Instagram. Yes, That's it. I want to, on behalf of Jason and myself, I want to thank James and Sarah. You guys have been awesome this week. You guys, when you're coming back, but I hope it's soon. Do you have a good time? I had a wonderful time. It's always yes. a good time. I want to congratulate you on your Princeton. Ah, uh, that's yeah. They did all the hard work. I mean, he wasn't, team. I mean, he wasn't out there shooting the ball. Uh, he lived it, though, Jason. You know, they beat he Arizona. He, lived it. he didn't wear the t shirt yesterday, so there was no fake <laughs> yesterday. He wore a t shirt today. That looks all crumpled up like it's been in a pamper. It's on the other side. And this team is special because of what they have up front, too. Micah Parsons makes a huge difference in the secondary. 
but I'm still going to roll with the Miami Dolphins. Jalen Ramsey and Xavier Howard, and I think the X factor for them is bringing over Vic Fangio as their defensive coordinator. He's going to be able to scheme things up and put these guys into position. And then also at the safety role, you have Javon Holland, a young stud. Mm -hmm. who a lot of people mm -hmm. believe is one of the best, if not the best, defensive coordinators in all of football. And Bradley Chubb knows that system. You have him for a full year mm -hmm. now. And you add Jalen Ramsey as a piece that you can move around. I, I, you look at the, they bring in their entire backfield back yeah. as well. Yep. Did the Bills get any better mm -hmm. with what they've added? I hope Vaughn Miller's to the guy mm -hmm. we all hope he can be because that's a blast to watch. But the Dolphins got better. Mm -hmm. And if that's the way the game ended with a third string quarterback, if Tua stays mm -hmm. healthy, they're not an underdog in the least. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what you just finished with, Tua stays healthy. There's yep. no way we're talking about them as underdogs. He was balling last year before going down with injuries. If you're talking about underdogs in this division, with them adding Aaron Rodgers to the New York Jets, it has to be the New England Patriots. Who? They would mm. be Who? the team that for so